fo fa fo fa fo fa fa fo 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 fa fa Jason Stewart here. I'm here at Good Girl Dinette in Highland Park. It is a Vietnamese restaurant that I love to eat at. I think it's pretty straight Vietnamese, but it has a little bit of an Americanized touch, but they're still keeping it true to the roots. I go to the farmer's market all the time. I see the chef there. She's buying all the, everything from the farmer's market, all the produce, fruits, veggies, all that stuff. Everything is like crazy organic. Uh, this is a great hangover spot because they have the regular pho broth, but they also have this nice porridge kind of situation. It's very healthy and delicious and nourishing. I mean, everyone loves pho. If you say pho, I don't really judge you because it is strange to a lot of people still. And it's also BYOB. I don't know if you're allowed to say that or not, but you can bring wine and beer here. It's cool. Aside from all the food and drinks and great things you can get here, the main reason I come is my brother actually works here. Isn't that fun? Hello, I'm here at Good Girl Dinette with Deep, the owner and head chef. As a Southern Californian, I just love the idea of a diner and I love diners. So when I thought, oh, you know, I really, what kind of restaurant would I want? And I said, well, I think one of the main themes is grandma's cooking. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, okay, well, what if your grandma was a dyke, <laughs> grew up in Southern California, went to farmer's market. This is how, this is a dykey grandma's, you know, yeah. diner. Someone coming here for the first time, what would you recommend they order for what you think personifies the restaurant? Well, they are all my children, so yes, it's You're totally gonna have to pick one. Deepy's choice. <laughs> Deepy's choice. The dish that I actually love the most is the, the black pepper pork confit. Ultimately, we're a, a neighborhood restaurant, and I just wanted just to have a place that I would love to go. I feel, I feel at home here. I was gonna say, yeah, it feels like home. So, and I grew up in immigrant neighborhoods, so it's just, you know, like, this is, this is, this is what I want. Well, uh, can we go to the kitchen? Yeah. And, we, and eat some of this food? Actually, you are going to make vegetarian. I'm gonna make vegetarian pho. You have to use your woman's intuition. Oh, okay, so give it a wiggle. Yeah. It looks like a jellyfish. But you want this to be boiling, because right. that's like the expectation. It's gonna lose heat when it goes out. Okay. Okay, all right. So now you're gonna add tofu. It's right in the middle. And then you're gonna add uh, cilantro. That's a lot, okay. Okay, so the, all the aromatics are collapsed. Yes, the, uh, so this hot broth is now Cooking those onions and cilantro a little bit, it's all getting all infusy and flavory delicious -y. Exactly, that's why you don't want to do it afterwards. Okay. okay. And then you get a little bit of um, serranos, and then the basil you're gonna put right on top. You're gonna okay. make it all pretty. Make it all pretty. And then you ring the bell, and then you... Oh! Exactly, you lose your mind if no one picks it up right away. Why isn't anybody picking up the fun? It's getting and cold. Then you <laughs> My favorite person to eat Good Girl Dinette with is my brother. Say hello. Hi guys. Turn into the mic. Hi guys. <laughs> This has been Good Girl Dinette. Thank you for coming with me, Stu, Deep, Highland Park. Come enjoy all of this bounty of cuisine, and I will do it now. <laughs>